our topic, um, the next our next topic is about the week three, which is introduction to the profession. Now, so this lesson is that you are expected to know the ICT career opportunities, explain the code of ethics for IT professional, familiarize with the common application used by ICT professionals, and then understand the ACM membership. So lesson one is the ICT career opportunities, okay? As an ICT student, you should be able to know the different career opportunities in your field. This can help you set up your goal as you choose your career path in the future. So guys, may I, may I ask you, anong course ba meron kayo ngayon? Computer science, IT, computer engineering? Okay. Uh, this in mind class, especially for you. Uh, I think you are on your, uh, ano ba kayo? Second year level? First year. First year or second year? Okay, second year. If you know the saying, you cannot be the jack of all trades. Saying, um, do not expect, guys. We are not also expecting you to be the jack of all trades. You cannot be good at everything. You cannot be good on everything that you do. Okay. Kaya nga, di ba, we have this what we call the um the left and the right brains. Eh, na parang oh, mas na function si left kaysa kay right or na function si much 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 uh, much na gagamit sa right compared to the left. Okay, now, um, we do not expect you to be um good or your uh, be your best at everything that you do. Okay, so, syempre, sa dami-dami na subject nyo, sa, sa, whole, sa whole course nyo, sa, sa, whole, sa whole ng pag-stay nyo kay AMA, um, hindi pwedeng lahat magaling ka. What I'm trying to say is that, um, for example, hindi naman po pwede na... Uh, Let's say, ang galing-galing mo nang mag-memorize, tapos ang galing mo pa sa mathematics, di ba? Magkaibang bagay kasi yun eh. So, uh, what I'm trying to say here is that uh, you just have to focus on what you're good at. Okay? Huwag kang panghinaan ng loob kung let's say, sabi natin, ah, bakit ang baba ko sa English, ang baba ko sa Pilipino, pero okay naman ako sa, sa, sa computing subjects ko, sa logic ko, sa mathematics ko. It's okay. Okay, wag kayong wag kayong wag kayong mapanghinaan ng It's because that as I have mentioned, you just have to focus on what uh, you're good at. Pero I'm not telling you na ibagsak niyo yon, right? So you have to do everything to pass that subject for you to pass your um, your course or your career. So basically, most important thing in in college is that you have to discover yourself. Okay? You have identify Saan ba akong magaling? Um, saan ako nag-excel? Okay? As I have mentioned, hindi ka pwedeng magaling sa lahat, di ba? Kaya nga may tinatawag tayong, meron tayong tinatawag na career pa. Um, through your um, through your passion, uh, doon natin ma-identify na, oh, ito pala yung para sa akin. Okay? Okay, introduction to the profession. Give you an idea of the different career opportunities of the ICT. So, the, what important is you know, okay, you know and you you already identified kung saan ka magaling. Let's say, magaling ako mag-graphic design. Okay, magaling ako mag-drawing, magaling ako mag-anime. What important is you you try to discover yourself, okay? Try to discover yourself where are you good at, okay? And then, with that, um, let's say you you finish your, um, your course in AMA or ABA or ACLC, Okay, at least you know what is your career path. Okay, now these are the different career opportunities, not limited into this. Okay, ito lang yung some of the example of the ICT career opportunities. We have the application developer. Okay, this is somewhere uh, someone who develops application for computers. So, ito yung mga nagpo-program para sa computers. Let's say, kagawa ka ng system. Okay? And then, the next one is the database administrator. Very crucial part of a system. Ito yung tinatawag natin back. Um, we have the database is the back end. And then, yung program na ginagawa niyo, front end lang yan. So, meaning to say, it's just a user interface. It's, an em it's empty kung walang database. So, the database administrator. The database admi administrator is the one who is handling the database knowledge on handling database you cannot um you cannot use the uh, the dbm or s or the database okay 
you should have enough knowledge on how to handle database. Pinag-aaralan po talaga yan. Okay? So, if you are good on handling the DBMS on the database, kung magaling ka mag-SQL, kung magaling ka mag-query, okay, you know the basics and then the advanced um, querying, okay, uh, administrator. This is the person who is in charge of the company's database. This is the data analyst, okay? So, when you say data analyst class, it is the one that collects and stores data on sales numbers, market research, logistics, linguistics, or other behavior. Okay, so next is to the web developer. So developer is also similar with the application developer doing the program, okay, for the computers. But the only difference is that the web developer is that um, they are focused on creating websites. Okay, sabi natin mga e-commerce site, okay, websites then you focus on the being a web developer next is the network engineer ayan ano yung network engineer so this is the person who is tasked in the net uh, network um uh, or the network connection okay so kung meron tayong problema sa mga internet connection network connection then definitely that is the task of the network engineer okay so kung mahilig kayo mag cisco Okay, infrastructure, then you can be a network engineer. Okay, this is to work with a company's computer network using information technology to make network system for all employees to use. Okay, hindi ibig sabi na network engineer, pang computer engineering lang yan ha. Pwede po yan sa IT, pwede po yan sa Association for Computing Machinery is a well-known organization for computing professional and professional conduct. This serves as a guide on how ICT professionals should use technology in an ethical way. It has four parts, okay? The general ethical principle, the professional responsibility, the professional leadership principle, and compliance with the code, okay? okay? But if you will recall, guys, okay, you have to ensure that you are following the code of ethics, okay? You are using your uh, technology in an ethical way. Meaning to say, do not hack. Do not attack, okay? Do not um do not um use phishing, okay? Scamming, okay? So those are the code of ethics of ICT professional. But then again, it is um categorized into four, okay? Let's move on. Let's start with the first category, which is about the general ethical principle. So a computing professional should first is that contribute to uh, society and to um human well-being, acknowledging that all people are stakeholders in computing so avoid harm be honest and trustworthy be fair and take action not to discriminate okay hindi natin ginagamit ang computer para for example nasa facebook tayo nasa social media account tayo may nakita tayong let's say hindi natin nagustuhan yung picture or yung image and then ibabash nyo or whatsoever so do not use that for discrimination do not use the technology for discrimination and then um, respect the work required to produce new ideas, inventions, creative works, and computing artifacts, okay? Next is respect privacy, okay? Do not steal, okay? Do not use the uh, some uh, somebody else account, okay? And then honor confidentiality, okay? So again, those are the general ethical principle. Di ba kung maaalala nyo, meron na tayong Data Privacy Act, Okay? So, a computing professional should strive to achieve high quality in both the process and products of professional work. Maintain high standards of professional competence, conduct, and ethical principle. Know and respect existing rules pertaining to professional work. So, give comprehensive and thorough evaluation of computer systems and their impacts, including analysis for work only in areas of competence, foster public awareness and understanding of computing-related technologies and their consequences, access computing and communication resources only when authorized or when compelled by the public good. Design and implement systems that are robustly and usably secure. Professional leadership principle, okay? So, a computing professional, especially one acting as a leader, should first ensure that the public good is the central concern during all professional computing work. Articulate and encourage acceptance of and evaluate fulfillment of social responsibilities by members of the organization or group. Manage personnel and resources to enhance the quality of working life. 
to articulate, apply, and support policies and processes that reflect the principles of the code. Create opportunities for members of the organization or group to grow as professional. Use care when modifying or retiring system. Recognize and take special care of systems that become integrated into this infrastructure society. Next. Next is after the four categories, okay, next is that the compliance with the code of ethics, okay? So first, you have to uphold, promote, and respect the principles of the code. Second, treat violations of the code as inconsistent with the membership in the ACM, okay? So the, what are the applications of the ICT professionals? It can be word processing application, email application, web browsers, spreadsheet, presentation, um, presentation, PDF readers, and antiviruses. Okay, next. So we mentioned about the ACM membership. Okay, so what are the benefits of ACM? So if you are an ACM member, essential IT skills and popular certification, online books and videos from Skillsoft, online books from Safari, Morgan Kaufman and Singres, videos and webinars on hot topics presented by today's innovators. And you will have the option to subscribe to the full ACM digital library, which includes over 2 million pages of text. So also, it is a, you can have a subscription to some of the ACM's magazine and journal. And then special discounts and access to valuable projects and services through the ACM's insurance and discounts and special offers program. Okay, so if you want to join the ACM, this is the site that you can join. Okay, the acm.org membership that uh, slash join. Okay, so that is the end of the week three. Okay.